Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name is Anna and today I have another seller's haul for you guys and I am so excited because we have so many new goodies out on the table that I am so excited to share with you and show you guys. I ended up getting a lot of stuff from different places. So continuing on from last week, I did have some shapes from Uruguay that I did want to show you guys. I have some Mexican fluorites. I have some Brazilian pieces. So this is kind of my little international table as I want to call it because I have a little bit of everything from a little bit of everywhere um, so yeah so let's get right into it let's get started I'm not gonna mumble too much because there is a lot to go over I ended up posting a ton this week just because I got so many new things in I just I couldn't help myself I try to control myself and not post everything at once but I really wanted to get a lot of these items up for you guys so as you can tell we have a mix of a lot of carvings some selenite some top polish so we have a really great variety a lot of different items to go through so let's get started because it is a lot so the first thing i want to start with is these towers back here if you guys don't remember a few hauls ago i did let you know that i did have some more top polish items coming in so all of the top polish items are from brazil and you guys they are so gorgeous Probably one of the last sellers to have these in my shop but you know what that's okay because you get different varieties you get different colors everyone has something a little different so i'm going to show you guys what I ended up getting. So the first thing I ended up getting in is of course mukite. You guys know I absolutely love my mukites. They are so gorgeous. Definitely one of my favorite stones. Now let me show you guys how beautiful. Now they do range from yellows to beiges to red, a lot of burgundy colors. So I did get a lot of nice variety up for you guys. They are so beautiful. Mukai is one of my favorite. It's absolutely amazing to travel with. It's really great for when you're going either overseas, even somewhere local. It's just a really great stone to have with you on your travels. It just helps you make better decisions, kind of keeps you a bit safe. So I would definitely recommend to bring mukite with you if you're ever traveling and then of course my favorites i have had to get some fluorites in for you guys so i do have some out from brazil i do have some out from mexico china actually has some really nice amazing quality fluorites as well so fluorites can kind of be found all over which is really absolutely amazing and i love the color in these each one has a lot of color i do have some that are just green but the majority that i did pick were colorful ones because I know you guys love your color I really like the colorful ones so this is an example of an all green one but again really beautiful a lot of them have beautiful rainbows here's another one a multicolored one they are just so stunning now I haven't seen florid top polish and a lot of top polish options when people offer them so I'm really excited that I got florids in because I do feel that that's not more of a common top polish that a lot of people have I feel like a lot of people do have rose quartz smoky emerald even mukites but i think flory is a bit more on the rare end to get in top polish form the next thing I do have as well are these beautiful rose quartz now I did have some a while back I did get some more in how gorgeous absolutely stunning and what I love about these if you guys do know pink does wash out on camera and a lot of these are not even washing out like you can see how beautiful and saturated that pink color is in a lot of these and I promise you it is a lot more pink in person so these are really top quality really beautiful and what's really great is they are palm sized about palm sized so they are going to be on the affordable side. They are not going to be really expensive. You guys know I really try not to up my prices too much. The next thing I want to show you guys, I also got beautiful Smokies in. Now I just wanted to show you different varieties. And don't worry because what you see on the table is not the only options I have. I have a ton of these. And don't worry, they will all be posted to Etsy. So I do have some Smokies in like a lighter, more transparent color. I do have some really beautiful, beautiful dark Smokies as well. Again, just all different preferences because I know there's people who like their lighter ones, people who like their darker ones. So I do. Have have a variety of those as well and then let me get on the other side for you guys and here are the emeralds how absolutely stunning and beautiful they are gorgeous each piece has a beautiful emeralds inclusions in it so gorgeous some more than others of course 
but they all have a lot of emerald in it just absolutely stunning and gorgeous oh emeralds is becoming one of my favorites i actually never got emerald before until i actually got some for my shop and i'm absolutely obsessed and i know i say that all the time but it's honestly so true there are crystals that you automatically connect with right so for example when you do go on my etsy when you do watch these videos there are crystals that just speak to you like you see them and you need to get them right but then there's just crystals that you never know you're going to get attracted to until until you finally have them so it's just it's funny how that works because I think way back when someone asked me are there crystals that you don't like or that you never do get and I think I said no before but there definitely are now that I'm noticing now that I'm actually a seller of crystals that there's definitely a lot of crystals that I did see before but never bought like in live shows I just never I don't know they just never really spoke to me like other crystals did but it's so funny now that I'm actually getting them in from the shop it's the complete opposite I become obsessed and I really love them and that's that's just the funny thing with crystals is that you never know what's going to hit you until you finally get it in your hands now the next thing i want to show you guys are some beautiful mexican fluorites and you guys whew, mexico has some beautiful 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 fluorites and if you guys actually saw my updated personal haul i had some of these hearts in here and i did mention to you guys that i did have some ordered for the shop and they finally came in so i have a variety of sizes but you guys, let me show you just how stunning these fluorites are. You guys, insane. And a lot of them have these beautiful rainbows. How stunning. Now again, I did get different sizes. So this is one of the larger ones. I do have some mediums and some smaller ones as well. Here is a medium one. Look at this, you guys. Look at these fluorites. I would say that Mexican fluorite definitely has more of like a pastel-y vibe to me. So it's a lot of pastel colors, like a lot of lavenders, a really nice mix of greens and blues. Just so, so gorgeous. You guys, they are breathtaking. And then let me show you some small ones as well. Oh, they're just, I cannot get enough. If you guys saw my personal collection, I do have about three or four in my collection and I do have one or two on the way because I just, I can't help myself. But look at how absolutely stunning these are. I mean, what? Even the darker ones, absolutely gorgeous. The colors in these are out of this world. I mean, are out of this world. It's even having a hard time focusing because they're just, you can't, like capturing their beauty in photos or even videos never does it justice. I mean, look how absolutely stunning. Oh, so gorgeous. I am obsessed. And then with the hearts, I also did get some free forms as well. Just because you guys know me, I love my fluorites. I honestly cannot get enough. So I also got these beautiful Mexican palm stones and they are fully polished palm stones look at how beautiful they are just absolutely stunning the variety of different colors from lights to darks oh i can go on and on and on you guys know me flora is one of my favorites but i will say currently i really am vibing with amethyst i've been drawn to amethyst so much if you guys don't know i actually ended up just splurging on a huge cathedral that i want to put in my living room and when that comes, she will definitely be in my updated crystal haul. I am so excited. She is a beauty. So I'm really, really, I would say amethyst. It was, it was so funny because fluorite was my top for a really, really long time. But I definitely am speaking more with amethyst this year. I think amethyst is really kind of vibing with me more this year. And then fluorite's my top second. And then the next thing I want to show you guys, I can't pronounce this. I think it's like chiropyrite i have to I, i'll find it i cannot pronounce it right but it's just this beautiful multicolored pyrite it's also known as i think aura aura pyrite or so peacock pyrite something like that i do have to look it up again but look how gorgeous these are the shine the beautiful different colors an absolutely gorgeous stone I will have the name listed up top, do not worry. I just cannot pronounce it for the life of me, but I definitely will list it for you guys. So I ended up getting some of those in. And then I do wanna jump over to, oh, I did also have some raw florets that I got in as well. And you guys look at these, a lot of these are beautiful blue color. 
let me show you guys so some more raw pieces so i do have the smaller palms that are fully polished but then i also do have these beautiful kind of raw a little bit of polished florets points as well but they are blue and purple that's why i really wanted to get these in because the coloring is just so gorgeous out of all the florets i would have to say blue florit is one of my favorite so I had to get those in for you guys as well. If you guys do not have blue fluorite, those would be at a super great price because they are raw, right? They aren't a carving, they aren't a tower, so they are in their raw form, so they'll be super affordable. Now, the next thing I wanna show you guys is I did get some more beautiful carvings from Uruguay. So I kind of wanted to split up my Uruguay order. I didn't wanna kind of dump it all on you guys in one week. So as you guys saw, I did have some beautiful spheres and towers from them, but I also did get some beautiful carvings that I did wanna split up and do kind of a little bit apart. I didn't wanna dump them all all at once because they are a bit more, they are higher quality, so they are a bit more expensive. But I wanted to show you guys these. Look how beautiful these amethyst this and agate moons are i also got some cactuses they are so gorgeous and super high quality again if you guys saw my previous video when i had the spheres and towers you guys know uruguay has some of the most beautiful and top quality amethyst and agates that i've seen come out of anywhere so really just gorgeous really well done also their carvings they always nail they do such a great job and they're so gorgeous now i do have some smaller moons as well right because the bigger ones are pricier the smaller ones are going to be at a more affordable price but look at how beautiful these are oh I am dying. I absolutely love these. They are so stunning. Now they all pretty much do have the raw backs to them, but you will get a little bit of the banding on the sides and then that beautiful druzy side. Oh, to die for. You guys know I love my druzies. And then let me show you guys some more moons. They are just, they're really stunning. I absolutely love them. And again, they are on the smaller side. I didn't get too many big ones just because I want them to be at an affordable price point for all people. Look how gorgeous. Okay, and then I have one more, one more moon to show you guys. Look at this beauty. Now this one's really unique because it has a beautiful druzy. But then look at that agate banding. Oh, you guys know I am a sucker for banding and druzies, and these just have all of them, and I'm absolutely obsessed. Now, the next thing I got, and I kind of wanted to get your guys' opinion because I wasn't sure if you guys would be interested. I did get some wings in as well. Now, I could get these individually, right, so you can buy it per wing. I also can get them on a stand and a double wing. So let me know if you guys would be interested in just more singular wings or if you would be interested in a double wing so you kind of have like a beautiful heart slash wing on a stand shape display. So let me know what you guys think because again, I could just get the wings separately and price that out this way or they also do make them where they come on a stand and there's two wings. So let me know what you guys would prefer because I didn't know. So I ended up getting just the singular pieces for now, but definitely let me know if you'd be interested in double pieces but how gorgeous and then also i fell in love with these little cactuses i thought they were so freaking cute and they just came in such a variety of different colors but you guys look at these oh look how cute oh i am obsessed am obsessed this green one really speaks to me i love her she is beautiful i love a green druzy i actually ended up keeping one of the moons and the moon that i did keep was a beautiful green moon because it is just so stunning. Again, they all do have that side of banding on the sides, but they are raw on the back. But nevertheless, really gorgeous, really beautiful crystals. Again, you could just not go wrong with the Uruguay crystals. They really are absolutely amazing and really gorgeous top quality pieces. Now look at this one. This one is a beautiful kind of like gray and green mix so stunning oh my god you guys i can play with these all day long and let me tell you guys i am not even mad when things don't sell because you know what they get to stay with me and i'm a happy camper because i absolutely love all of these crystals and it's such just amazing and positive energy from them that i cannot complain i am not mad when things sit around because it just gives me more time to stare at them and look at their beautiful beautiful sparkles shines rainbows 
oh i just absolutely love them now the next thing i want to show you guys i also ended up getting some beautiful carvings in these really cute moons i want to say about two three months ago i did have carved moons in fluorite ones and you guys snagged those up so quick so i did get some more options i do have some more fluorite coming in so i did get some beautiful gold sheen ones and rose quartz ones again really gorgeous they all just have this really cute smiling face to them really nice that gold sheen one is just oh you can play with gold sheen all day it is just such a stunning stone look at that beauty oh you guys know i love my crystals and i'm so happy that i ended up starting this business and just going for it because my passion for crystals has really really expanded but now that i can bring all these beautiful crystals in at like different price points it's just it's opened my eyes and just has made my passion for crystals that much more stronger. Now you guys, I'm gonna show you something super unique, something I have not seen before, but I thought was really, really unique. I ended up finding these beautiful quartz clusters, but let me show you guys these because these are so crazy. I've never seen something like this. Look at how beautiful these clusters are and you're probably looking at it and you're like what's wrong with them or what's going on with them so i'm just going to show you one by one these are double clear quartz clusters yes guys they are double clear quartz clusters so let me explain the crystallization and the way these clusters formed they formed one right on top of the other so if you guys can see this is the base of one of the clusters right with the points coming out this way and then here is a base of another cluster with the points coming Coming out the opposite way they literally grew right into each other how freaking unique is that if you guys are looking for some unique pieces this would definitely be it and i would definitely say i think you can stand it up on one side a little bit and then i would just lay it kind of flat because it just looks better flat so you can really see the crystallization in between them but how freaking unique is this like i thought this was so unique now let me show you a close-up so do you guys see all those points how insane even on the base side they have some of these points such a stunning and unique piece like i've never seen something like that that i had to snag them up now this same thing it's just two clusters that formed right on top of one another it is so cool so the cluster kind of formed this way this would be the base but they kind of cut the base off and then this would just be a bigger cluster on its own but this cluster grew into this cluster how freaking amazing now this is all well okay it's not natural right because these were polished and cut up so they can obviously be sold but this is how they naturally grow like a lot of crystals naturally grow right on top of one another so then can you imagine all the work that goes in to make them into towers into spheres you guys it takes it, it's a lot of work but to see like two clusters right on top of one another i thought was so cool and i've never seen something like that before and now some of the last items I want to show you guys are on this side, so I will make my way. So the first thing I want to show you guys is I did get some more pyrite in. Pyrite is known as fool's gold, but do not be fooled. Pyrite is actually a really amazing, amazing stone to have. It's also a stone known for wealth and abundance, so I would highly recommend pyrite as well. I know a lot of people usually go to citrine for abundance, but pyrite is also really great now i just wanted to show you guys these are really beautiful a lot of them really have this beautiful like they're not really druzy some pieces are druzy but a lot of pieces do have this beautiful like natural box design to them which is absolutely stunning and they are super affordable because they are smaller clusters and then i also did get in some beautiful apophyllite clusters and the way i labeled these or the way i decided to do it because a lot of them are smaller i decided to do them as sets versus listing them one by one because it would just be way too much so it's actually going to be intuitively picked so if you guys don't know what that means that means that i will pick the set for you i believe i'm not sure yet i'm either going to make them a set of four or a set of three and again they are small right they all fit in my palm but they all have this beautiful sparkle like if you guys love apophyllite i thought these were really great to do as just set deals because they are on the smaller end so it didn't make sense to do them one by one so i did decide to put them up as sets just because i thought they would look better and just made more sense versus one by one but i just want to show you they are all super gorgeous each one has 
amazing druzy on it so it will be picked intuitively but i promise you each set will have beautiful sparkle beautiful shine and i have a lot of these little ones so i really am excited for this i really think this is going to do really well because they are going to be on the affordable side because they are smaller and they will be picked by me just because it would make more sense than posting them randomly one by one and then with the apophyllites i also did get some agate pears in so i did have regular druzy agate small little clusters before but i decided to get beautiful pears in so what that means is it is the other side of a beautiful druzy agate geode how gorgeous and i do have different sizes so let me show you what i'm talking about so this would be what one of them looks like right if you line it up this is what it looks like and then when you break it open you get the beautiful druzy pockets so again i do have some bigger ones i have some smaller ones as well just because again i do try to get things for every price point Here's another large one. I mean, absolutely gorgeous. So all of them have this beautiful crystallizations and druzies in the middles, all the banding throughout the sides, but they are raw on the back side. But how cool are these? I thought these were so amazing. I had to get them in. All right, and here are the babies. They are so cute. So again, they are just pears. I did have these, kind of sold them one by one before, but I thought the pears were so much cuter that I had to get the pears in, how cute. Now they are raw on the back, they are covered because I haven't had a chance to uncover them yet, but I will for the sale, don't worry, when they go up on Etsy. But how beautiful, again, they all just have some gorgeous druzy. And again, these are agates, so they are more on the affordable side, which is really great. And I just think the pears look a little bit better than the individual ones do, because I know people like to mix it up, people like some different things here and there. And then a favorite of yours that a lot of you guys have been asking, a lot of you guys have been asking me to get selenite in the shop again. So don't worry, I do hear you. So I do have these really cute towers. They're a little over two inches. So I do have those in. I also have a ton of selenite coming in. I have some palm stones coming in. I know people have asked me for some bowls. I have some bowls coming in. I do have a lot more selenite coming in, so don't worry. And then I did have wands way back when. So I did get more wands, but these are considered like crayons because you see kind of at the top, they are more pointed, but nevertheless, really gorgeous, really beautiful. And I mean, just look at that shine so insane so i did get some more of these in i did get the towers in i also do have a lot more coming in so don't worry if you don't see something you like in the selenite variety i do have more coming in so i really hope you guys enjoyed please let me know in the comments section down below which was your favorite out of today's haul because i really do want to know and i think i'm going to start doing that i think i'm going to start asking you guys which was your favorite so i get an idea of what people are liking what i could pass up on in the future so yeah let me know until next time as always thank you for the support and i'll talk to you guys later bye guys